It was a routine foul ball, but what happened in the stands was far from normal. He uh, was trying to react to catch the, the foul ball. Whoa! Oh my goodness, pray that he's okay. Oh dear God. But he leaned too far, falling 30 feet onto the fans below him. Everybody just kind of stared and watched as it happened. That was, that was jarring. Say a prayer, folks, and pray quickly. Now, that fan is recovering from the foul ball fall. Pretty uh, scary. She wasn't born in anorexic, but nowadays she suffers. It is a disorder that has been associated with prominent Hollywood stars like the Olsen twins, Nicole Richie, and Lindsay Lohan. The destructive pattern may have led to the early death of Brittany Murphy and earned these women national attention. Eating disorders, and now groups all over the country, are applauding what can be a life-ending disorder, saying, go for it. It gives users a high, just like marijuana, and K2 is legal in Texas. Nobody's killed anybody on it, or nobody's died of it yet. It doesn't have any bad effects. But tonight, Allen could become the second North Texas city to ban it. We feel it's very important to be proactive rather than reactive. I think Allen is really, really doing everyone a service. More cities and the entire state could follow Allen's lead. Drunk drivers led to more than 1,200 deaths in Texas last year. The state leads the nation. We're number one for drunk driving fatalities. Now state leaders are considering tougher laws aimed at stopping drunk drivers. It was a Father's Day tragedy. Dad's gone, one of them a killer who left families and a community shattered. Today, the Lancaster Police Department and others said goodbye to one of the men killed last weekend. One of their own, Officer Craig Shaw. I don't care what other moms do. Working moms have their hands full. More and more women are taking on the role of sole breadwinner and mother. But what happens when the stress becomes too much and mom's world starts to crumble? It seems like the plot of a movie, and it is a mother's worst nightmare. A four-year-old boy allegedly taken from his own home and held for ransom. Only this story doesn't have a Hollywood ending. The child was found dead, and the alleged kidnapper is still on the run. Whiskey River, take my mind. It's the stereotypical theme song for every country singer who's down in the dumps. Yeah, man, that's the good stuff. Spear 30, a honky tonk time. Pop a top again. Drown your sorrows with a beer. But a new study shows an unexpected shift. Now it's teen girls searching for answers at the bottom of the glass. 